yet another round of strike today, days after they resumed to work. Addressing the press led by KMPDU Secretary General, uh, the union accused Nairobi Metropolitan Services NMS of failing to implement the agreement signed on the 26th of August. After signing a back-to-work formula on the 26th of August with the Nairobi Metropolitan Services, doctors in Nairobi are back on the streets. This time, accusing NMS for failing to implement the conditions agreed upon on the back-to-work formula. We are back to the streets again. It's unfortunate. We all know that uh, on the 21st of August we issued a strike, seven day strike notice, which started on the 28th. According to the union, most doctors have not yet been paid, and those who have been paid have received huge pay cuts. The doctors also complaining of lack of a medical cover, all this despite being frontline workers during the COVID 19 pandemic. Nairobi Metropolitan Service will conclude negotiation of a comprehensive medical cover by the NHIF and issue cards by 4th of September. That has not since happened. So up to now we still don't have a medical cover. We also agree that there are four consultants that have, the four consultants have to be put on payroll and pay their 26 month salary. Now currently as we speak is the 27th month. They have not been paid. The union has now advised its members to down their tools until NMS makes good of its word by addressing their grievances. We had committed that by the 5th of every, every month we will be downing our tools unless we have been paid. It's unfortunate that today, the 15th, most of the doctors have not been paid their September salary. NMS has responded to the claims, saying that the delay has been caused by Treasury due to the revenue-sharing standoff that caused a delay in the disbursement of funds to counties. Zainab Mohammed, TV47.